what's poppin' everybody, what's good, man? Back at y'all with another new beat, you know what I'm saying? I'ma go through it, let y'all know what I did. And, let's see, first thing I did, I seeped out this sample right here. And, this be pretty dope, so, I'm gonna play this sample right now, make sure it's not on that. And now I'm gonna play it. Here's how it sounds. Oops, turn the volume up. First set of high hats, and this is how I got them. Got them like this. Why is it doing that? Let's see. Got right there. Alright, now I forgot there. Okay, yeah. So now you hear that high hats now. I made another layer with the other hi-hats that was doing them like this. And let's try to hear this one too. Oh, let me get right there. Now up close, I know y'all, that's like three hi-hats right there. I squeezed them all the way together like that. Then of course, you know, I did my separate, um, my separate volumes and stuff like that. And there's it, so many ways you can do these hi hats, man. Like I told you, I know like all the techniques. And like I said, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell, so that way you do not miss no videos. Cause every video has a different technique all my old videos different techniques that nobody else is doing on youtube or something and you know by subscribing to my channel you can use these techniques on your beats and surprise a lot of people that be asking you how you did it you know what i'm saying so but moving on let's see we got uh let's go with the snares these ain't no ordinary snares though <laughs> These ain't the ordinary snares. They're more like uh, I, I would say like rim shots. It's more like a rim shot snare. And it sounds decent though. I turned the velocity up so it can stand out a little more. And we got um we got some subs. Got a sub right here. I'm gonna start right there. So that pretty much, uh, I don't know if y'all heard it through there or not, but you know, but that sub sounds so damn good. You know, that's one of my favorite subs. Uh, it's one of my favorite subs. I even double layered them. <laughs> I double layered them and I double layered the kicks. And as for the kicks, um, I went down a key. I went down to a, uh, another key right here. So... Sometimes I do that. I always raise the velocity on my kicks. So you can stand out more, hit harder and punchier. And here's how it sound. Oh yeah, you know I love punchy kicks, man. And as you see, I used the um, I used the love filter, but this time I used it on certain parts throughout the song, and of course I got my volume envelope up there. Um, how I mixed everything down was um, 
the subs, it was pretty simple, you know. I just moved, I just moved this, um, this number one right here, I just moved it over to 72 hertz and moved it up a little bit. Then, put a stereo enhancer on it, put a soft clip on it so it'll keep it balancing while going to red. Um, same thing with the kicks. I just used the stock, um, I just used, um, pretty much stock of the kick, you know what I'm saying, so, all I did, I just went here, and I didn't do nothing special too, I just went simply, clicked on kick, and that was it, and then I put a stereo enhancer on it, I didn't turn it up, I just left it the way it was, and for we saw a clip or so on going to red, I had some, pretty much similar, you know, um, a little bit of reverb, not too much, I only put that much in there, you know, not too much, and then, and so it's stereo, I didn't go up too much, I just went up a little bit where I thought, you know, where I like to do that, and, you know, because I love throwing my own feel to it, that's the same thing, and I didn't move that nowhere, because remember, they two hi-hats working together, so, I had one hi-hat going like that, and the other one going like that, so, so that's how I differentiate them. And for the snare right here, I really didn't do nothing, but I just, um, I pretty much did, um, like I said, I just used the presets. This time I went to um, tight drum sizzle. So I tightened drum sizzle the snare, and then I went to, um, I went all the way up with that one on stereo separation on the enhancer. And free reverb, same thing. I didn't, I turned that down all the way. You know, we don't need too much. Just need just a touch of it, and that's about it. This one, I just put a soft clipper with it. That's all I did, so. But anyway, like I said, if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date and not miss not one video. All right, I'm gonna play the full beat. Uh, like I said, you know, make sure, oops, that'd be wrong. I don't know why I just did that. Oh, that's the hi-hats. Hi-hats number two. Uh, so I didn't realize that. I didn't realize I did that. Anyway, let's see. Other than that, anyway, I'm going to play a beat, man. Make sure y'all get in the comment box. Let me know what y'all think. Hit that subscribe button. And hit that notification bell so you won't miss a video. All right, here we go, y'all.
Well, that was the beat, y'all. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure, hey, if you're new to the channel, make sure you just hit that subscribe button. And hit that notification bell so you won't miss not one video. And I'm finna sign off, y'all. Make sure y'all tag y'all favorite artists. Share this on y'all social media page. Share this with everybody. Let everybody know about the channel, man. Because we about to go big, bro. And shout out to all the people that have been following me and that have been, that been with me from day one, man. I appreciate all y'all, man. Let's get this channel buzzing. Let's get this channel big. All right, y'all. I'm out.